Well guys, welcome back to the channel. This is episode number two of Mark the Irishman. Obviously, I'm Mark. If you didn't get that from the last video by now, I don't know what to tell you. Now for my second video, given it's the 13th of March, just a quick mention, that's my mammy's birthday. So happy birthday, mammy Mark. Love you lots. We're gonna look at my first ever Paddy's Day in America. Let's dive into a little bit of history on St. Patrick. It's worth noting, none of this is based on fact. This is the ramblings of an Irish guy. I reckon St. Patrick was probably, I don't know, he was around 100 years ago, let's say. And about all I know is he ran all the snakes out of Ireland. That's about it. That's about all I know about the man. And we celebrate that. I think. If I'm wrong, prove it in the comment section. Being an Irishman in America, my first Paddy's Day, my decision was to dress up as Irish as I possibly can to stand out from the crowd, be treated like a local celebrity and not pay for a single drink all night. How wrong was I? Here's a shot of me arriving on my night out. Come out you black and tan, come and fight me like a man. Up in the morning to you. And here's a look at the kind of people I was dealing with on this night out. Hello. Yo man, where you from? I'm from Ireland. Ireland? You expect me to believe that with that accent? You know how I know you ain't from Ireland? I've been to Europe, but you know I'm not Irish based off of this two-sentence conversation we had. Nah, man, I know you ain't from Ireland because I've got a friend from Australia. Oh, you, you know an Australian, and, and that, that's why you know the accent can't be Irish. You got me. I am. Now, I know that looks far-fetched, but that actually happened. And don't get me wrong, I had a great time. By the end of the night, one of my good friends Noah had to take my card because I kept trying to buy people shots. It was that kind of night. I was doing everything I could to not look Irish and deny it if asked. It's worth mentioning, no one celebrates Patrick's Day in Ireland the way Americans celebrate St. Patrick's Day. You turn a river green in Chicago. If you go to New York, you've got floats the size of city blocks. You turn your beer green. In Ireland, we put some fences on the side of the one road in and out of the town. We get the local donkey, the farmer, his tractor, and the fire brigade if they're available, and we throw ourselves a little parade. So kudos to the Americans, you leave us for dead on the celebration of St. Patrick's Day. We don't turn our beer green, but we'd have about 45 pints in two hours. And uh, you'd probably have 10 more anyway. All right, guys, thank you all for watching. If you liked the video, like the video. Also, feel free to share it on social media, share it with your friends. Try and get this channel as far and wide as we can. I'm loving the support from you all so far, so thank you very much for that again. Goodbye for now, Slán go forth.